I think there's a, a lot of thinking behind it. Um, firstly, I'd like to go back to why we played Sarfaraz. Um, I think we wanted to set a precedent where we wanted to reward people that have been playing red ball consistently uh, in domestic cricket over the last few years. You saw that with the selection of uh, Khurram Shahzad and Amir Jamal, even though uh, I think a lot of people felt that it was quite risky putting two debutants out there. But I thought that they handled themselves well and, and we have to give them credit that their first outing against Australia and Australia was quite decent. So the reason of playing Sarfaraz was pretty much the same. Um, I know people go back to stats and Rizwan averages very well in Senna. Firstly, there's no competition between the two. Um, they're equally important to the team. Whatever competition we feel there is, there's healthy competition. We know what Rizwan has done, but we gave Sarfaraz the benefit because he averaged 56 and a half when he came to Australia uh, in the last tour in 2016. Yes, that's been quite a while, but he's also played red ball consistently in the Kaide Azam Trophy for the last few years. Um, Rizwan just came from the World Cup, a lot of white ball cricket. So we felt that he needed some more time. And he also had a gap in test cricket where when Sarfaraz took over from him during the New Zealand series, uh, Sarfaraz had an outstanding performance there. And Rizwan really hadn't played a lot of test cricket or red ball cricket. Let's put it to red ball cricket because we don't really play enough test cricket all over the years. So there was some method to it. So we thought that we would go with Sefi in terms of he's been there, he's played more red ball cricket. Karachi had a very good season where he scored a lot of runs. He was the MVP of the tournament. Um, and, and that allowed us some time to get a player like Rizwan into, into shape. For me, if I had it my way or if we had it our way, we'd ide ideally like both to play, but that's not possible. But um, now we think that Rizwan is ready uh, and we can give Sefi that little bit, bit of break to sort of recoup, come back. And again, more of a tactical decision uh, in terms of the conditions and what we can get best out of each player in those conditions.